Welcome to the A-Star Cloud PBX Quick Start Guide, presented by Vox Telesis. In this video, we'll be demonstrating how to configure inbound routes on the A-Star Cloud PBX. Inbound routes instruct your PBX on how to handle incoming calls from the public phone system. The simplest and most common inbound route is to send an outside call directly to an extension. In this example, we're going to point the 10-digit DID 212-555-2368 to John's extension. We will also set the failover inbound route to a call group. Before we get started, you will need to make sure that you have properly configured your Vox Telesis trunk and have an extension set up. If you need any help with any of these prerequisites, please check out our previous videos. We'll start by clicking on Settings. Click Call Control. Under the Inbound Routes tab, click the Add button. Enter the name you wish to give your inbound route. Enter the 10-digit DID provided by Vox Telesis into the DID pattern field. Under Member Trunks, make sure that Vox Telesis is in the selected column. You can send a call to many destinations in the A-Star Cloud PBX. Some of the most common are IVR, Extension, Voicemail, and Ring Group. We will discuss these destination options in upcoming videos. Choose Extension from the Destination drop-down menu. Another drop-down menu will appear, so go ahead and choose the extension where you wish to have the calls routed. In this example, if a customer calls 212-555-2368, John's desk phone will ring with the customer's phone call. Click Save when finished. We want to make sure that if a customer dials any number that isn't covered by our inbound routes, that they will be routed to the proper destination. We'll do this by clicking on the Edit icon for the Route In Inbound Route. Go ahead and change the name to Failover. Notice that DID pattern and caller ID pattern are intentionally left blank. When you leave these fields blank, any DID pattern or caller ID pattern will apply to this route. Under Member Trunks, make sure that Vox Telesis is under the selected column. In this example, we're setting the destination to Ring Group. We will cover Ring Groups in an upcoming video. Click the Save button. When an outside call comes into the PBX and it matches the route's rules, it will be sent to the correct destination. If the phone call does not match the rules of any other inbound route, the call will go to the failover route. Inbound routes are read from the top to the bottom. We want the failover route located at the very bottom. Click the two bottom arrow button on the failover row. This will move the failover inbound route to the bottom of the list. Click Apply to ensure that all changes to your Yaystar Cloud PBX are saved. You have successfully set up inbound routes on your Yaystar Cloud PBX. In upcoming videos, we will configure inbound route destinations like interactive voice response menus. If you have any further questions, please check out support.voxtelesis.com.